All right, uh, here we go. A little bit ranting about some idiots on the internet who are telling you to detox from dopamine, uh, not realizing that uh, dopamine isn't a poison, it's a neurotransmitter, and there's nothing to detox from. And yes, to be fair, some mean or responsible dealing with things that give you some dopamine impulses. But it, it's more complicated than that. And let me quickly shine light on that. Dopamine is a neurotransmitter that does many, many things. It's, it's not that easy, right? Uh, but the two main things that I want to highlight here is, first of all, it's reward prediction. Now, if you see something that you would might like, the brain goes like, how would it be if I had that reward? And that is the mesolimbic system going like, I want that. It's wanting and liking going on at the same time, first liking, then wanting. And then motivation emerges and the dopamine impulse motivates you. And actually dopamine here in the motoric cortices facilitates movement. Like Parkinson, for example, is a disease where the dopamine system isn't working properly and where movement problems emerge. So dopamine is also in the brain something that is going for the movement. Uh, and movement is also tied to motivation, movere on Latin. So motivation lets you like a goal, lets you want a goal. Imagine how great it is to have that and that gets you moving. And that's the key thing. And, and you don't want to not have it. You don't want to detox from that, but you want to channel that into the right direction. You want to have a dopamine detox not on TikTok and social media, but on reasonable, purposeful goals. So don't detox from dopamine, but channel what you should do on the important topics. So make sure you follow the important things, the purposeful things, and not just any social media video, and that will optimize your dopamine good enough.